This video is sponsored by the 3D Artist Coloring Book. Transform your texturing skills with pre-made, professional-level assets and in-depth tutorials in the workshop. The first month is completely on us, so try it out for one month completely risk-free. Link in the description. Welcome back to Best Game Art of the Week, where we showcase this week's most stunning game models, environments, visual effects, and tools from the game art community. Now tag your post on Twitter with the stylized station hashtag for a chance to be featured. Now let's get right into this week's art. Joshua Florente, Manila Map. Joshua says, this is a stylized environment design inspired by Overwatch's art style. This personal project aims to further improve my environment production workflow. All assets and materials have been created by me. Xavier says, based on a concept from Ho China, but I decided to change the face and some details. I did this project following the CGMA course character creation for games with Patrick Young. Thanks for a lot of the feedback, it really helped me improve my workflow. And you guys by now know that I love my grungy alleyway scenes. So here is the aptly titled Alley by AFUN Interactive. Nick Carver, The Flock. Nick says, here's some in-engine footage and concepts from my recent work with Coherence on The Flock project. Maria Nazivia, Persian Market. Thank you. 
Nicole as a party. Senior thesis. Nicole says, the following playable environment was my solo thesis that I worked on while at Ringling College of Art and Design, responsible for lighting, all asset creation and texturing, set dressing, composition, and all textures were created in Substance Designer and Painter, and all assets were created in Maya and ZBrush. The environment has been assembled in Unreal Engine. Neon Cross FX by Najibi. Najibi says, this is the first time I used Popcorn FX. I am comfortable with Unity Particle System, so at first I was kind of lost, but I learned quickly and it was extremely fun. Favorite pieces this week by Saman Mamudi, Zelda vs Ganondorf. Saman says, a fan art piece of Zelda where she's dressed in her chic uniform whilst trying to protect the Triforce of Wisdom from Ganondorf. And finally, Trim Rotor with Overgrown, real-time scene. Trim says, I started this scene under the mentorship of Kevin Meek while I was at the Think Tank Training Center in Vancouver. I was inspired by an artwork of Wadim Shashkin and took it further from there. I learned so much through this journey and there are so many things I wish I could do over again or improve upon, but I just have to call it done and move on to something else with the lessons I learned. Sean Tissero helped me with some shader stuff. Without his material shader, my house would look much less worn and old. Make sure to subscribe to get weekly videos on the best game art in the game art community. As usual, I'm Stylized Station, and I will see you guys next week for another best game art.